In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make little pots of agar like this. These are simple to make, very easy to inoculate, keep sterile and store. This is freckled chestnut, lion's mane, perfect for beginners. Let's get started. First thing you've got to do is weigh out 6 grams of brown rice flour and 9 grams of agar into a mixing bowl. Next, measure out 400 millilitres of boiling water and then add it into a palm. Add the mixture into the boiling water and then stir continuously until it's all mixed. When the mixture starts frothing like this, it means the agar has correctly activated and the mixture is ready. I like to pour the mixture out into a lab bottle like this as I can store it, sterilize it and reuse it another time if I don't use it all in one go. Put the lid on the lab bottle and place it in the pressure cooker to sterilise along with the pots. I leave the pots to settle for 5 minutes and then I wipe any excess condensation off from inside the pots and put the lids on. If you're using unmodified lids, then tighten the lid up and then loosen it slightly. This will allow pressure to escape during the sterilization process. This will stop the pots from warping or cracking. If you're using modified lids with a hole in the top, then just put a layer of micro pore tape over the hole. Put the lid on all of your jars and then place them into the pressure cooker. Sterilise your pots for 30 minutes at 12 to 15 psi. Check all the pots just to make sure the lids are on tight before you remove them from the pressure cooker. Mm -hmm. 
prepare your still air box by wiping it down with 70% alcohol solution and spraying the walls of the still air box with soapy water. Next, place all of the items into the still air box, wiping all of them down with alcohol first. Give everything a wipe down with alcohol. Position your items inside the still air box carefully, loosen all the lids off the top of the pots and then inoculate each separately. For the modified pot with the hole in the lid, you can inject through the hole and then replace the micropore tape after inoculation. Finally, secure the lids on all of your pots and then store. Your agar pots will be ready to use in about 7 to 14 days. If you've made it this far in the video, then thanks, good luck with your agar pots and don't forget to like and subscribe.